Hello YouTube. Uh, up this came this morning uh, the Space 1999 John Koenig 6-inch uh, action figure which I'm going to get out. This is the box as you can see. So I've got this in the post. Uh, I'm really happy about this. Uh, so the box is really nice. So I've got the figure in front, uh, you get all the utilities with it, the stun gun, helmet and uh, everything else. Uh, I'm going to take it out of the box now, but I did show it on the, going round on the spin table thing. Uh, but I do love the box and designed by uh, 1612, 1216 sorry, is really good. Uh, I've bought the some other stuff I'll include that in a minute but let's get this figure out of the way so you get a nice little background for him to stand in which is rather impressive I do like that actually will I use this display thing at the back I don't know we'll have to wait and see but it, actually, I have to say, when you're going with a camera, it's like you're moving around inside, which is sort of impressive. So there's the figure, right, in its thing. Uh, what I'm going to do now is I'm going to go straight to building it, but you get the helmet, his oxygen tank, there's the front part, Comlock, stun gun. Uh, I'm looking forward to looking at the face sculpt on this. Should be interesting. And so that's the helmet, which opens up. So very nice. Do you know for the six-inch figure, I am impressed with this. So shall we take a look at the face sculpt? of this figure so I love the stand I think the stand for this is awesome so let's go up the front the suit's nice this, these are very nicely detailed figures no wonder what they're selling them for uh, they released 2000 of them they've already sold out of this one I've had to go for pre-orders on the other but there's the uh, stun gun. Now, here, instead of like having straps, you just, there's like a wedge at, at the group, you just push it in. You know, the oxygen sort of pack. Uh, go up to his first sculpt. I think his first sculpt is awesome. I think it's quite good for what this is. Trust me, they're charging enough for these figures. But it's, uh, I do like the stand, so I'm just gonna turn him round. I think there's a great likeness of him. Uh, I love the details down here, the alpha badge. Now, now the oxygen tank at the back. You just push it into the figure, which I really do like. Uh, it made it easy. You know, normally when you get a figure, you get little straps and there's loads of messing about with it all, which is really annoying. But as you can see, right, I'm going down. So I'm going to put the helmet on now and uh, let's see what that's like. So the helmet fits on very easily. Just lifted it up. I think I'm going to pause him with the helmet up. Now there's two backgrounds, you can use the, like the eagle entrance, it does look good does that, how the artwork for that's being done, the photography, uh, but I'm just going in, now is this worth what they're charging, if you're a collector like me, and this is one of your old time favourite series, yeah, now if you're a mainstream buyer, you know a bit about it, no, but, these things are got the starting to go up in price 
and they're going for stupid money. I was looking at the Alan Carter and the Moon Buggy, but I think that's far too much what they're asking. But I, I do want a set of figures. I have put a deposit on the 12 inch Koenig figure that's coming out uh, from this company. Is it 1216? You know, so I have bought quite a bit from Jerry Anderson and building up a small uh, Space 1999 collection. Because a lot of us missed out first time round when we were kids. I had the Dinky Eagles and that. But from what I've seen on YouTube, I never knew there was so much stuff released, you know, back in the day. So I'm just going to pull out now and I'll put the background on. So here we go, that's the figure there. So I've done that review. Uh, just a quick one, this is the Laboratory Eagle I picked up from Eagle Moss. I have to say, I'm in love with the Eagle Moss series. I've got the Booster Rocket one, I'm going to order Eagle one, and then I should be up to date with that. I do have the big 12 inch Eagles. Now, I did get the book as well. The technical, I did miss out on the one with the briefcase. Uh, I'll show you it now. So I got that and the Moonbase Alpha Technical Manual. As you can see, it's fantastic inside. I'm not going to open it up. Uh, I was going to do a review on it, but it's, uh, I'm not going to bother. Uh, I don't review a lot of stuff because I don't buy as much now. But I'm, anything from the past, like Space 1999 uh, figures, I, I just love the 1216 collection. I think they're great. And I think that's what I'm focusing on at the moment. Now, this helmet here, they are bringing out one to one scale ones, but I mean, they're nearly three hundred pound. I saw I saw them for two sixty nine these helmets, but I don't know if I'm going to get one. To be honest, uh, I'm more interested in the twelve inch figures. Uh, I just think they're going to be awesome. But there's four on the way, but then it's going to take quite a while to release them. But the eagles uh, from Eagle Moss are spectacular. Uh, the Moonbase Alpha Club. I did get this. Uh, these are the latest things. It's the notebook. I won't be using it. I've ordered the badges actually. Uh, so I've been buying from Jerry Anderson at 1216. Plus I know a dealer who gives me a bit off. And he's been really good because he knocks a few quid off which I'm quite happy about. So I bought off him before. So that's good. But yeah, let's, uh, so that's the Kearney figure and that, that's my review. So guys, I will see you on the next video. Have a great day and stay safe.